Splitting of the moon. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. اقتربت الساعة وانشق القمر وإن يروا آية يعرضوا ويقولوا سحر مستمر وكذبوا واتبعوا أهواءهم وكل أمر مستقر. The last hour draws near and the moon is split asunder. And if they see a miracle, they turn their backs and say the same old sorcery. Hey, also gave the lie to splitting asunder of the moon and only followed their desires. Yet everything is destined to reach an end. Chapter 54, verse number 1 to 3. Sadaqallahu <laughs> The Holy Prophet Wasallam's miracle of moon splitting had occurred five years before immigration from Mecca to Medina. It is narrated by Abdullah ibn Mas'ud and ibn Abbas. They said that during the lifetime of Muhammad Wasallam, in Mecca, many Meccans, non-Muslim inhabitants, Abu Jahil, Walid bin Mugir, Asi bin Wali, Aswad bin Jabira, Aswad bin Abdul Muthlib, and Nazar bin Haris came to the Holy Prophet. The non Muslim inhabitants demanded to see miracle. They said that if you were really true prophet and a messenger, bring to us a miracle to establish the fact of splitting the moon in two halves and further demanded the one part of the moon must be upon the mountains of Abi Kabis and the other part must be upon the mountain of Qais Khan. Further, it must keep on coming to one side and then to the other side between the two mountains. The Holy Prophet ﷺ stood for supplication to Allah to support him and grant him victory in this hard situation. Allah, may he be exalted, inspired him to sign towards the moon with his finger. Immediately, the moon cleft into two parts, standing far from each other for a period of time, then cling back together. The Holy Prophet wasallam said, Be witness, it had occurred, O people, see it. The pagans started claiming, O Muhammad wasallam practiced witchcraft on us. They saw the miracle, they cleaned their eyes and again saw it again and again, but they denied this miracle. They used to go to ask different people, the passengers, the travelers, the caravan, but all of them said the same as the people of Makkah had seen.